Okay, so should we do this? We ready for this? Are you ready for this? Am I ready for this? Not really, but uh, we gotta do what we gotta do. Hello there, my little pooligans. My name is Matt Pool, and welcome back to Seven Nights at Freddy's The Hunt for the Third Star. Custom night it is, and you're gonna make me reset it back to 20. Can I type it in? No? You gotta slowly make your way. This is a good sign. This is a real good sign. Yeah, we're doing fine. We're already doing fine. I'm so boned. I'm gonna die. Ah! Stop making me. Am I gonna have to do this? Ah! I'm so pubescent at hearts. Am I gonna have to do this every single time I fail? Am I gonna be back in the main menu and have to reset this to 20, or is that something that only happens when I exit the game? That's what I want to know. Here we are, night seven, and I, I thought about this long and hard. That's not a euphemism for anything. Uh, I'm going to go with the same exact strategy that I went for with nights three, four, five, six. The only uh, difference is it's not to keep Freddy in place. Well, it is, but it's not to keep him on the stage. It's to keep him in the corner. Whenever the game decides that I should be so lucky as to it loading and me speaking proper English, I don't English good. English not good, me. Come on. I'm so gonna suck ass. I'm gonna suck ass balls. Ah. Hi. Ah. Oh, I suck so hard. Oh, I suck so many penis balls. Oh, don't quote me. Don't quote me. Uh, Foxy's gonna kill me. Uh. Fuck! Ah, uh, I didn't check Foxy at all. Oh, uh, every time I start playing, I get like, ugh. I was going real slow there. Um. Oh, it's gonna take a lot more than that if I want to actually have any chance of beating this. Alright, so I didn't end up checking. I don't English good. You understand I me? What I have to do is do the left cam. Left, right. See, left. I don't direction good. I good direction as good English. Me, good. Yes. Freddy, please don't suck my ass. I'm sorry I didn't get to play with you the first six nights. But in my defense... You can eat shit. It's not a very good defense, but it's all I've got. Hi. Oh shit! Oh, Freddy. Damn it! Fuck me! Fuck! Ugh. Son of a bitch! Welcome to my nightmare. Super monkey balls. Oh, uh, Freddy, don't you touch my super monkey balls. Why did he have black eyes, too? That's a little disconcerting. Here, let me, e let me ease any tensions anyone else may have by tapping Freddy's nose. Hug for me, bitch. Oh, testicles. Big, juicy testicles. What up? Bonnie faux shizzle. My main N-word. Freddy moving away. Yeah, that's right, Freddy. You go suck Chica's dick. Suck it. Never questioning the fact that Chica's a female, but has a dick. Of course, I say Fox is my only threat, but they all make me nervous. But I need to check on Foxy. Fuck! Freddy, can you stop laughing at me? You're such an inconsiderate asshole, you know that? Fuck! Bonnie's in! We can do this! You and me, two or three people watching this, we can do this together, alright? You're gonna help me get through this, I'm gonna help you get through this, even though you... I don't know what your, what role you're gonna play, but... Nose honk! 
But the last one, Bonnie got in because I was dicking around on the right side the whole time. Not actually. Uh, turns out I got my dick caught in the right door. And, uh, ooh, this is awkward. And then I was like, kill me now, and Bonnie was like, okay. Thank you, now I can check Foxy, who's already in running stance, fucker! Yeah, Freddy, I hear you. SHIT! Holy shit! FUCK! WHAT THE HELL?! He wasn't even peeking out! How am I supposed to, how am I supposed to combat with that? How am I supposed to do anything when Foxy attacks me so many fucking times. It's a shame too, because he did a long wind up there. Can you imagine, like, I, if I, like, I, there's a chance that I could have had a chance had he not hit me three times. All he had to do was not hit me three fucking times, and there was at least a slight chance I could have survived because Freddy did his long ass wind up there, which is not very, which is not very common in 420 mode or at all. Why do I have to go through six hours of this crap? See how long it took him? See how long? Oh, I spoke too soon. So he took forever to start his wind up. Then he played a song for two, two fucking seconds like a Prickosaurus Rex. If this bugs out on me, though, it's gonna cost me. Well, it's gonna cost me my life! Oh, I have no life. I sold my soul already. Being so funny and charming and handsome. Three honks for good luck. If it hey, if it work, if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work. What the fuck? Are you shitting me? How the fuck is Foxy already running at me? See, it's it's entirely random chance. Wait, I actually didn't hear the thump yet. And Chica's in the room. Fuck me. What the fuck? Ah. What? Uh, let me fix my pants. My Pikachu pajamas. Like them? <sighs> They're almost as cute as I am. <laughs> That's what you sound like. You sound stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking mongoose. <laughs> hey Bonnie, what's up? Bonnie's my main bitch. Bonnie's not an actual bitch though. He's actually a really cool guy once you get to know him. Until he makes you wet yourself. And he bleeds nightmares, by the way. Just like that. Fox. Bonnie's in the room. Fuck. This is truly a challenge. This is the most challenge. This Night 7 is the most challenging thing I've ever played. And before I even started playing Five Nights at Freddy's, before I even played the first night, I told myself, well, there's no way I'm going to beat 420 mode, but at least I'll give it a few tries if I even make it there. And then I kicked ass. For the first six nights, I know I can beat this. Most of these attempts have not failed because of my lack of skill in this game. And therein lies the problem. My fate, with the exception of instances like that, I let my guard down because Foxy went in a couple of percentage points from completely hidden to already ready to run. And it's I'm letting it mess with my head. I'm letting it mess with my goddamn head. 
the fact of the matter is, on all, most of these, I have executed my strategy perfectly. Or as close to perfection as I can possibly muster. And my fate, when I am perfect, when I execute my strategy perfectly, my fate is suddenly in the hands of a random number generator. And that bothers me. It bothers me that skill being perfect is not enough. Skill is meaningless right now. I'm not giving up. I am never gonna give up. I will play this whether it takes me one more try, whether it takes me a hundred more tries. I'm gonna do this. I am going to master this. And I may only be able to beat it once in every hundred t attempts. <laughs> Fuck! See- Come here, sweet. Come here. Hold on, I'm not trying to get you. See, this is what I'm talking about as far as distractions. You know what happened? This little one rubbed up against my back, I lost my focus, and Freddy got into the room. Now I forgive you because you're fucking adorable, okay? But, okay, say hi. Say hi to my subscribers. Camera shy? Well, too bad. You decided to get me killed. I was already gonna lose anyway, it's okay. You do not like this at all. You're upset. Oh, you think you're upset? I'm upset. My hand is already slipping. That is really bad. That's not on me though. That's fuck. Forgive me if I don't talk much. Bonnie's in the room. That time Foxy wasn't as bad that time. Is this not recording? Son of a bitch, it wasn't even recording. I don't... Hi, buddy. <laughs> ah, shit! Fucker of mothers! Who is it? After every time, after every failed attempt, I like sit here, process what happened, and just ponder the meaning of life. Now I didn't do it perfectly with any of those, but the fact of the matter is, unfortunately, that doesn't matter. Being perfect is only half the goddamn battle, and that's what's so unfortunate about this whole thing. No matter how perfect you execute your strategy, it still probably won't be good enough because of a random number generator for Foxy. Oh, I hope your mother gets diarrhea. I hope you get diarrhea. It's not even 5 a.m., so it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, I'll do it right away. I'll punch you in the dick. Punch right in the mouth. Swallow your, you're gonna be swallowing your teeth and shitting them out in the morning. Ba boom! Wow, he really waited, huh? What was he trying to do? Cop a feel? Damn it! Fuck! Bonnie's already in the room. Is it Bonnie or Chica? Freddy doesn't move unless you do his. What the? F I can't even... I can't... I... what? 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 Alright, so I've died at 12 a.m. a couple times in a row. That's it. Remember our target? 
tap, right? You're not gonna even come in here. You're not gonna touch me, all right? You're coming in here, you're gonna touch me, great. This one got me killed by Freddy yesterday. Kit, that's exa see, that's exactly what you did that cost me my life last night, Kit. Bratzels. Why the half not? I looked up strategy last night after I stopped playing. There was nothing I was doing wrong. I was not making many mistakes. I was doing nothing wrong during the attempts that I executed my strategy perfectly. You'd think my overtime payment of 50 cents would have been a, uh, enough for me to say, fuck this job, I'm getting out of here. Instead of going in that goddamn next night. I'm just, hey, hey, fuck face. Yeah, I'm talking to you. It's because we broke up, that's why he's so pissed. Screw it. I don't fucking care. I'll enjoy a snack while I wait for my dude. If he hits your door twice, it doesn't matter. Plus, he's gonna hit it again and again and again. You're gonna hear that thump very soon. Just gonna enjoy my demise. I'm gonna make it taste good. Mmm, so good. This way, I don't have to sacrifice myself. I can take a bit of a breather. I can do it too. It's not that scary if you know it's coming. It's not a euphemism for anything. So how about, yeah, basically, every time Foxy charges me twice, I'll just shut the doors, continue to enjoy a snack. That is a strategy I'm okay with. That is a strategy I can execute perfectly. When everything's fucked, plus that means not having to give Fox the satisfaction of killing me. Uh, it forces Freddy to do it. Did the, did the camera just meow at me? Did it just meow? That's awkward. Fox is on the run. Once again, doesn't matter. You gotta enjoy a snack, it's only 1am. Are you shitting me? I might have to try Big Bug strategy. Which is, all right, let's think about this. I have to do anything I can to neutralize Foxy. I've already lost, so I'm just gonna enjoy a snack. Like I said, new strategy. It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. What's the matter? Paralyzed with fear? You afraid of me? Afraid I'm gonna punch you straight in the dick? You amalgamated dick? Probably broken anyways. Wouldn't do much good. Or harm. Are you pissed because I get to enjoy a tasty snack and you don't? And you have diarrhea? And you have no balls? I think what you're starving for most, Foxy, is attention. You're a lousy piece of shit. I'm so sorry that I e I am sorry that I ever wanted to have my babies with you. Some people just do not handle breakup flow, you know? Oh, it's a long one. It's an extra long one. Not the jingle, the stick, the pretzel stick. Might as well, and when I fail, I might as well enjoy this because this is the only good thing I've got going for me right now. What does it even matter? What's real? What isn't? How can I know? Nothing matters anymore. Nothing is sacred. Everything's shit. 
or so if I to see when Fox is actually about to attack. Great! The whole gang's here! So I'll have one great big gang bed. At least Fred is waiting a while. The problem is, it's 3 a.m. when he waits a while, not 5 a.m. It's very possible that I need to find a much better balance to this game. And I definitely need to because I cannot tell you how many times I've already done the intro to my video in the hopes that this time would be it. And, uh, alright, so we're gonna do this. Why can't I put down the cam? I can't put down the cam! What the hell? I can't put down the camera! What the hell? It's not working! Fuck, fuck, I'm not, I'm not even, something's gonna get me eventually. It will not let me put that. This is a great start. I got a half hour left, and this is a great start. I can't put the camera down. My game glitched. So eventually, Bonnie and Chica can pull down your monitor. For those of you who didn't know, if they're in the room, they can rip down your monitor if it's up for so long. See? Chica got in the room and was like, fuck this shit. Bah! Um... So that was not a good start. So much for my goddamn strategy. Apparently being trapped in the monitor is not a good thing. And no, that was not the actual strategy. All right, everyone's, everyone have a good laugh. We're having a great time at my expense. Who cares? I'm gonna beat this night and then I'll laugh and cry at the same time. But probably mostly cry. Gotta have fun with it. Gotta have fun with it. I don't know how that glitched right there. I don't know if that's ever happened to anyone. I'm sure it has. I don't know why that happened. Maybe it's because I was pressing my luck. When you hear the dum dum da dum dum something or other, that means Foxy is completely behind the curtain. Why did I do that? Wait, Chica, what? They were both in? Okay. So, I know which one wears the pants in the relationship. It's really the first time Foxy hasn't given me much trouble. Of course, now these two assholes are gonna be, like, at my throat. I'm not doing that badly on power, either. I'm gonna need Freddy to play it a longer jingle if I make it that far. And Foxy's gone. My chances are very low. But, okay, at this point, I'm just gonna sit, because I don't think it's gonna happen. But you know what, please, 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 I beg of you, don't fuck me, please. This has to be it. This has to be it. I have done so well. This is the first time that I've actually had a motherfucking chance. This... Oh, please, Freddy, be good to me! No! Shit! Oh, shit. He's, he started doing it right away. He started doing it right away. He really wants me to die. I was almost perfect.
Fuck! I kept my mouth shut the whole fucking time. That is the first time. This is the very first time I have done 420 mode and Foxy without Foxy attacking me twice. I finally had a fucking chance. What happened, what ultimately cost me was Freddy, he played his song right away. But he waited forever, which means I had to have been mere, a mere second or two away from winning. I've still got 15 minutes, so I'll keep going. I have time for two more attempts. Uh, but that is, oh, I knew, I, I didn't want to even jinx it by saying one fucking word. Foxy didn't attack until late in 4 a.m. What happened was, at the end, Bonnie and Chica both appeared in the doorway at the same time, multiple times, forcing me to keep both doors shut for extended periods of time, and that cost me everything. But I just proved I can beat this, and I will beat this. It may not be tonight, but it will happen. Oh my god, it's so fucking stressful. I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna try it again. Because I know I can do it. I just, I finally, this was the first time I proved to myself I can actually do it. I, god damn it, I'm going to do it. What I have to do. Yes! Oh my god! Mother of god! I did it! <laughs> oh, 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 shit! Oh my god! Oh. Oh. I'm fired. Fuck you! You can't fire me! I quit! Fuck you! Oh, three stars! Oh my god! Yeah.